afternoon, everyone. Hey, guys. Well, today has been kind of slow-ish. Yeah. We didn't mean to, but we slept in just a little bitty bit. And Scott, he did a lot of cooking. He had bought a whole chicken, and he decided he was going to coconut bake it. Bake it. Yep. So I made some coconut baked chicken, and I think I'll try out a different way of cooking it next time because it turned out to be a little bland. And so I got some baked chicken at least. Well, my problem wasn't the fact that it was bland so much as it, well, in, when you bake the coconut, with this recipe anyway, the coconut didn't brown. Yeah. So it kind of resembled the chicken still having feathers. Just a little bit because the coconut didn't brown. It was still, looked feathery a little bit. That's <laughs> kind of funny. And Scott also decided he was going to fry all the innards. Yeah. I walked through the house and he was taking the chicken apart and in his hand he was holding a little heart. Yeah. Yep. Heart. I fried up all the innards plus the chicken neck and I used the same batter that I did with the baked chicken and it turned out a lot better fried. Needless like to that. say, I did not try that one. No, she didn't. I enjoyed it. So anyway, now we are headed in to take Scott to work, and then I'm going to meet up with Chelsea and pick up uh, Gingy, which is our puppet for the Shrek the Musical that we're making, because I forgot it at rehearsal last week, and she's been keeping it safe. So later, I'm going to go walk with my friend Brandy. Well, that driver was an idiot. Yeah. Everybody is too much in a rush. I mean, yeah, I need to get to work, but I compensate by leaving a little earlier. It's not worth dying over people, really. Yeah. But anyway, we had a car just run up on the uh, trying to pass in the slow lane, and the slow lane was running out. So it is about midday, probably about 1:30. I'm getting ready to clean up a little bit in the bedroom. And then my plan is that I've got some stuff to work on on the store. I need to at least get five items or so up today. That's my goal. And then it is time to blog. Today is the day when um, another one of my blogs come out. I've not told you all, but I have started a blog. It is at www.everyoneisroyal.com. Yeah, you all should check it out and leave comments and subscribe and let me know what you think about it. I would love to hear your input because... This kind of marks my really recent return back to vlogging. I've been vlogging for a little bit now, but I had taken a break from vlogging for a little while, and it's felt really, really good to get back into it. So it's been fun, and I'm excited about it, and I want input. Scott has went to the store on his way back from class. He's bringing home stuff for me to make for dinner. I wanted to try making pot pie which I've not done in a really, really, really long time. I've made chicken pot pie before, but I want to try to do beef pot pie tonight. And it's a really old recipe from like the 70s, which I'm probably going to get bashed on a little bit because I just said that was old. But for a recipe book, it's, you know, it's getting a little up there. But yeah, I'm going to try my hand at that. I've been trying random recipes from this recipe book, and some of them have been really great. Their Christmas candy from this recipe book is not to be messed with. I mean, it is amazing. But some of the other recipes haven't been as great, so we'll have to be sure and let you know what we thought of it. Tonight, Scott and I are going to go help out with Spotlight Acting School's rehearsals for Peter Pan. It's really cute. It's Disney Junior's version of Peter Pan, and it's a bunch of little kids, and they're really adorable, and they are having a lot of fun, and the people that work there and run it are great. So it's really cute to help out with them. But now it's time to clean. I'm in the process of making dinner and I'm making pot pie, beef pot pie for the first time. I've made chicken pot pie before. And the recipe says I have eight minutes left to go. It really looks done and I don't have aluminum full because the recipe didn't call for it. And I'm a little worried. I took pans and put it over the pies and I'm hoping that will work and that everything will all come out just fine. But we will see. Mm -hmm. 